Soldier Field, Chicago, Illinois. This venerable stadium will be a wild scene tonight. Two of the oldest rivals in pro football history meeting the Green Bay Packers and the Chicago Bears. And the Windy City, Chicago, has been upside down this past week. The Bears are undefeated and off to their best start in 43 years. While the Green Bay Packers have won their last two tonight, they'll be looking for the upset. I'm sure he would have liked to, but he has been very busy <laughs> dodging Bears. Here's Aldo Greco, 42-yard field goal attempt. Zorn is the holder, former Seattle Seahawks quarterback. That ball is blocked. Bears playing Bears football. And out of the pile comes Richard Dent. Rush the refrigerator. Now Richard Dent. A flag is down. From the end zone, we'll see that blocked field goal attempt. The first thing you want to do as a defensive unit is get penetration. So they push the Packer offensive line. Look at number 98. Tyrone Keys at six foot seven. He gets up there and gets a hand on it. There he is, <laughs> big number 72. Thunder and lightning. First and goal to go. Hey, oh my. Oh. Hangs in behind oh. the refrigerator. And this crowd loves oh. it. They've been writing about this. Oh. They stuck him in the backfield a week ago against the 49ers. Many thought out of spite for Bill Walsh's use of Guy McIntyre in the NFL championship game, NFC championship game a year ago when they used Guy McIntyre in the backfield. But look at him. Look 350 at 350 pounds leading Walter Payton. He hits George Crumby, number 52, and watch him. Oh. <laughs> it took him right out of the stadium. <laughs> That's Crumby. <laughs> Fell out crowd for Green Bay three weeks ago. He's in there now. Andy Wright, he can run it. A lot of distance hit from behind. Chasing him down was Dan Hampton and Tyrone Keyes. Second down and four, Bears. Walter Payton. Payton, and they'll mark it inside the one-yard line, even though he falls close to the goal line. Well, I don't want to be redundant, but they can do this all night. Every time Walter's gotten his hands on the ball, there have been real nice holes up front for Walter to run through, and I think Walter can run for well over 200 yards, but they continue to give him the ball tonight. Look at this. No Huge penetration. opening. And the first Packer went for the ball instead of the tackle, and you don't arm tackle Walter Payton. He takes it all the way down inside the one. First down, goal to go. Payton now. Six carries, 55 yards, three receptions, 31 yards, and Perry is in the offensive backfield for the Bears. He'll be the lead blocker. They give him the football, and Perry, <laughs> touchdown. <laughs> William Perry spikes the football, and this crowd loves it. They've been reading about this all week long. <laughs> I'll tell you what I like about him. He looked like Marcus Allen on that play. He was airborne. <laughs> and there was nobody trying to catch him. <laughs> no airport was open. Perry may revolutionize short yardage offense. <laughs>